Hey guys, it's me. So basically this video is gonna be like uh, 50 plus things to do when you're bored. So I hope you have fun watching this. Make sure to like and subscribe. Um, follow me on all my socials. And and give me video ideas because I have none. You can learn how to ride a skateboard. This is a little tricky for me, but uh, you could probably do it. It's, it's, it's different. When she just rolled that into that big pile of mud, tries to wipe it off in a puddle. Here, hold this. You can practice a new sport or a new position in a sport and do not judge me. This is my second day practicing um, pitching. You could work on your tumbling skills. This is a fun activity. You can make lists of things. Stop talking like that. I. You could start a bullet journal. You can learn slash practice. An instrument. I don't know how to open this. What do you mean? You've had that. Oh, I found it. Next, you can clean your room. You can also clean, clean out, and reorganize your closet. I did that the other day, and this is how many clothes that I got rid of. Oh. <laughs> um. Next, you can clean out your school backpack. Next, you can redo your room with new decorations and new paint. I have that whole box right there of stuff that I'm gonna use when I redo my room, probably this summer. So we're gonna learn some hard yoga poses because that's the next thing you can do. The floor is very cold. Oh, your carpet sucks. Then let's take it out. Take out the carpet. Punch, punch, punch. Hashtag carpet when we There we go. Oh. Yeah, please punch me in the face. Uh, I'm not gonna punch you in the face with my hands. Okay, that literally wasn't even that hard. Now we're gonna try a different one. Let's try doing the candlestick. Oh. <laughs> Can you put my carpet back, please? Oh, I have to. Because you're the one who had the idea to move it. Then let's take it out. Okay, so the next thing is really random. But it'll probably keep you busy. You can... I have the hiccups. You can dust off the top of your fans. Because they're probably really... Okay, excuse me. Because they're probably really dirty. Next, you can... Are you okay? <laughs> I drank water. That was <laughs> disgusting. It seemed like you were going to throw up on me. The next thing you can do is find new music. I suck at this. Andy. I can't do it. What? I like just a job. You like me, my goody shoes. <laughs> Unless you don't a need A song that you should guys should listen to is You should guys. Right? by Gabriella B. Huh? Feeling all, feeling all Right by Gabriella B. It's a pretty good song. Right. Next, you can write your own music. I can't do this either. Just let your creative juices flow. Let's combine them. You can start a YouTube channel. I have a wonky ass eyebrow. Look at it. Oh, Ooh. you have like a perfect curve. Like, look at that. And then there's my eyebrow. That's because you don't let anyone tweeze them. Tweeze? Or pick at them? Pick at them? Who picks at them? <laughs> I pick at them. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Stop! You just spit on me. If you don't have a phone?
Oh god, get away from me. I'm sorry. <laughs> Just get out your no. iPad. Start vlogging. Mm, the other thing you could do is pull an all-nighter. And then you could vlog that. Smart. <laughs> do you like my duct tape? Sorry this whole video is like ADHD. Um... So, yeah, you could try to become TikTok famous. It's not really working out for me. But that doesn't mean it won't work out for you. You can have a self-care day. So, you can basically just get your face mask. Number 16, you could watch my videos now there's only like six of them so it'll keep you occupied but you might need to move on to something else when you're done um you could <laughs> you could cook or bake something Mm, if you just heard the timer go off, my mom just made bread. You could do school. You can catch up on school. Because you probably need to. You could build a fort. Me and my sister did this on Tuesday. And it was huge. We put my mattress in there. And we used it for... Four days, I think. We took it down yesterday. Friday? Yeah, like four days. You can make an obstacle course. I do this with my cousins all the time when we're at my grandparents' house, usually for like family dinners and stuff. We take like pillows and stuff and we like lay them out on the floor and you can like only jump on the pillows. So it's like an obstacle course and you like, it's kind of like the floor is lava. You can take a nap because you probably haven't had, I don't know why I keep playing with my hair, because you probably haven't gotten all your sleep. You can play a game with your family or siblings. It, whoa, my hair's shiny. Anyway, um, so you could play like Goldfish or like Scrabble or Uno or something. It doesn't matter what you play. Me and my family like to play What Do You Mean? You can do your nails because if you're like me, your nails need a little bit of help. You can find new outfit inspiration and hair, oh, hairstyle inspiration. I mostly use Pinterest and TikTok for this. Sometimes for the outfits I use Instagram, but not really. If I find like a really good outfit, I'll like take a picture of it. I'll like put it in a folder in my photos that's like outfit ideas so that if I don't have an outfit idea, I can like look through there. I don't know why I keep talking. You can have a photo shoot. You can have someone in your family take the pictures for you. Or you can like set them up on a timer and just do it that way. You could try to solve a Rubik's Cube. And if you're anything like me, that'll take you a while. Coming in at number 29, you could plan a hypothetical trip. Now obviously it's hypothetical because we don't know the current situation of what's going to happen. You can make TikToks. I know this keeps me entertained. And depending on the dance, it could be a cardio workout. And going along with that, you could make up your own TikTok dance. Just pick a song with some beats in it and 
clap every time you hear a clap. Do some different. Ooh, and there you go, you made up your own dance. You can teach your pets tricks. I know this will probably keep you entertained because your pets might not be listening to you. You could get yourself flexible or get your flexibility back if you lost it. Just stretch a lot and keep working at it and you'll you'll bend like no other. You can online shop and if you don't have any money like me you can online window shop which is just looking at things that you want and not buying it. You can watch YouTube, Netflix, Disney Plus, Hulu, whatever. You can just sit there, binge watch stuff, entertain yourself. My head hurts from raising my eyebrows so much. Otherwise, I mean, I do that because otherwise I feel like I have an RBF. But anyway, so yeah, you can just, you can, you can binge shows, movies, videos. You can tie-dye things with Sharpies. I love doing this. It's fun, it's easy, it's entertaining. All you have to do is get a white piece of clothing, such as like, I don't know, a really common one is like those white Nike socks that go like halfway up your leg, you know? So you just get those, color them in with some Sharpie, and pour like rubbing alcohol on them. And then you just wait for them to sit, and they'll look tie-dyed. And it doesn't come out in the washing machine. It's really fun. I just ordered some white sweatpants to tie-dye. So. You can look for money in your house. Now, this does, this does not mean like stealing from your parents or your siblings or anything. Like, do not steal. But I'm saying like, if you have like old like wristlets or something you could like look through there to see if there's any extra like change left in there you could look in couch cushions because technically that's not stealing but do not take money from other people so sorry the lights are different my ring light like died so that's why the lighting is different so that you can actually see me so anyway another thing you can do is make new pinterest boards organize your pinterest boards and organize or like clean out your instagram feed so it like looks better i don't really care about that personally so mine's like random ugliness but so am i so you could learn cool party tricks and this does not have to be drinking it could be like i don't know spinning a basketball on your finger if you don't know how to do that saying the alphabet backward z y x w v learning rap god just something cool that you could be like hey i have this cool secret hidden talent you know um so another thing you can do is research the law of attraction and if you don't know what that is basically it's like you can have anything you want as long as you believe that you can have it. You Oh, goodness me. You can find new Snapchat filters. Because sometimes I get a lot of enjoyment out of this. Because there's just so many. And there's so many like different kinds. So, like There's the funny like face morpher ones. There's like color filters, there's like the ones that say like things above your head, there's like interactive ones, so. You can find podcasts to listen to. I don't do this, but apparently a lot of people do. We're already on to 45, why is this like crooked? We're on to 45, and this is, you can watch Vine and TikTok compilations on YouTube. Some of the like funny TikTok ones that I watch are like an hour long. So that should keep you busy for at least an hour, I guess. And the vine ones are kind of hard because usually you've like seen all those vines before. So I look up like unusual memes and there's like 80 different videos of that. Those are funny, so. You can declutter your, declutter your electronics. So like you can go through all your 
pictures, delete the ones that you don't need. You can go through all your music, delete, de oh my gosh, delete the ones you, <laughs> you don't listen to anymore. Um, you can go through your laptop, delete all the files you don't need anymore. Um, you can delete all the apps you don't use, the games you don't play. You can take personality quizzes, so like what Disney character you are, stuff like that. Or like personalized quizzes, so that's like... Even if you don't end up ordering the products, they're still fun to take some time. So like the Function of Beauty ones, um, an Ipsy one, stuff like that. You can find pictures and print out pictures for a photo wall. This can be so much fun because... Like, they don't even have to be pictures of you. They can be, like, the Tezza wall collage kit things. And you can, like, find them on Pinterest and then, like, get the Google Docs app on your phone. And then, like, download the image from Pinterest and put it on the Google Doc from your phone. And then you can print it off from either your phone or your computer. And then you can, like, trim it. And then just put it on your wall. And it looks cool. I... You can make jewelry, um, that's fun. Three more. Okay, so this one is, you can count things in your house. This should keep you busy for a long time, so you can, like, count windows, count doors, count corners. Counting corners takes so long. And the last, this is not an exciting one whatsoever. I don't know why I saved it to last. I didn't even save it to last. It was just last on my list. But learn a new language they have like the duolingo ones i'm pretty sure you can watch like youtube videos it doesn't even have to be like a talking language like you can learn sign language that's a language so that was my video i hope you guys enjoyed watching um if you didn't i'm sorry that you don't find me entertaining i don't find myself entertaining either but apparently some of my friends do so, I mean, maybe not, I don't know. They say that I'm entertaining, but I, anyway, um, yeah, make sure you follow me on my socials, like I said in the beginning. I hope you enjoyed this video, the 50, 50 51 things to do when you're bored at home. So, bye, love you.